Welcome to Full Sail University. Welcome to Friday Night NXT. Jam packed inside of the stadium, Orlando, Florida. Let's get started for Friday Night NXT. We are set here for our first bit of action here on Friday Night NXT. The Brian Kendrick is in action. Ladies and gentlemen, the Brian Kendrick has been on quite of a losing streak and that is due to his latest rival, Chris Danger. But Brian Kendrick has a big task ahead of him here tonight because tonight is the return of Carrion Cross. The monster is back. Carrion Cross is here and he there I don't think I don't think I don't, look at the he is scared and I would be too if I was standing across the ring from Carrion Cross and Carrion Cross with a Triple H style knee right to the face And the man with a plan looks like he got something. Karrion Cross is no man to deal with. Oh my God, what a scoop slam. Oh, and Cross. They're going back and forth. And Cross. Oh, and down goes Brian Kendrick. Cross trying to grab him. Brian Kendrick says... He's saying, forget this, Karrion Cross, yelling for Brian Kendrick to get back into the ring. Looks like Kendrick is leaving out of here. No, but oh, there's, there's Danger, Chris Danger, throwing the Brian Kendrick back into the ring. Oh, and the DDT. Karrion Cross is down. But what about that? The, oh, and that kick does nothing. Oh, and he just throws him off. Oh, that form. Oh, and the baseball fist. That could possibly be it for the Brian Kendrick, and no, it is not. Oh, and the knee right to the. Look like the nose. Oh, and a big boot, a standing big boot, takes down the Brian Kendrick. Brian Kendrick hasn't really had a chance to get into this match. Oh my God, what a close line. Carrying Cross is very destructive. Karrion Cross gloating a little bit to the crowd. Oh, but that's not going to affect his ability to stay on destruction. It looked like he incorporated the second rope for that choke. Oh, and what is this from Karrion Cross? What a. Oh, he going for three amigos. Carrying cross with three amigos in the bridge. One. No, it is not enough. S 
so athletic and so agile. What is he looking for here? What is this? Oh, and he got him into the cross jacket. The cross jacket. But he just, he just, he just released it. He released it. I don't know what that was for. He's going for the pin. Could that be it? Is he sleep one, two, and three? The losing streak of the Brian Kendrick. The losing streak of the Brian Kendrick continues. What a dominant performance from Cross. And look at this. I don't think carrying is done yet. Oh my God. What a vicious, vicious suplex there. Oh, he looking for Los Guerreros. Three amigos. Once again. Uh-oh. He is not letting up. Kick to the midsection. And he's looking for it again. The, the cross jacket. And immediately he taps out. But the match is already over. Cross dominating as of late. And we got one-on-one -on -one action here. The Bella Twins are here in NXT. And why is Brock Lesnar's main Titan Tron playing? Uh, okay. Okay. Anyway, Nikki Bella is in action here on NXT, ladies and gentlemen. And she says her opponent, she says the opponent for tonight is way too easy for her. I don't know how confident that might sound, but this lady sure is confident. Josie Jane, the up the newest upstart here in NXT. Josie Jane has been on fire all week since her win over Candice LeRae last Friday. Josie Jane. She looks ready. But she has a big task ahead of her. Former Divas champion. Nikki Bella. Oh, and straight out the bat with a drop kick to Bella right to the face. Oh, and a counter from Josie Jane with a flapjack. Oh, and Bella looked like she's going for a power bomb. No, reverse into a pennant predicament. Able to get out of it. And look at this. Josie Jane is showing herself. Oh, and a big chop. Oh, and a boot takes down the former Divas champion. And the current 2020 Hall of Famer. I don't think Brie Bella had, has had a chance to get into this match. And another elbow strike. She's wobbly. Oh, as she shoves Josie Jane off. Oh, what a forearm. And what is this from Bella? A little too close to the ropes there. 
Oh, and a chop takes down Josie Jane. And Brie Bella with the, oh, what an arm drag. Oh, and once again, going for, for, for a quick win, but no, Nikki Bella is able to get out of that predicament once again. What is this? Oh, my God. Did you see the way her head bounced that whiplash? Be uh, 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 Nikki Bella has a very well-known neck history. Uh, what is Bella looking for something devastating? Oh, whatever. Oh my God, Whoa, what a STO. And Josie Jane. Oh my God! I drag picking her up by the hair and slamming her down. That cannot feel good at all. Oh, and what is this from Brie Bella, Alabama? Slam, and I think Josie Jane's neck whiplashed off the second rope. Oh, and Brie Bella. Brie Bella is showing exactly why she is in the Hall of Fame along with her sister Brie. Josie Jane looks like she's starting to fight back. Oh, what is this? Oh my goodness! One, two, and no, it is not enough to put down the Hall of Famer. Referee got knocked down momentarily. Oh, and she misses with the big splash. Brie Bella looking for that submission once again. A modified. And Josie Jane is in pain right now. She's trying to fight out of this. And she does. Oh, what a takedown. Oh, went for a super kick. Brie Bella saw it coming. Oh, one step ahead is Josie Jane. And what a roll up, roll up. Could this be the win? No. This crowd is on their feet. Oh my God, what a hammer fist. Pin and no. The Hall of Famer once again kicks out Josie Jane. Does not know exactly what to do now. She is going up top. Josie Jane is going up top. Looking for a big splash and she gets it. Halfway across the ring. And yet again, Nikki Bella is able to get the shoulder up. Uh-oh. What is this? Oh, no. No. She's looking for it. Rack attack. The rack attack to Josie Jane. Oh, but she didn't go for the pin right away. She did not go for the pin right away. This could cost Nikki Bella one, two, and no. She is able to survive. Oh, and what a drop kick from the second rope. Uh-oh, she got, she got Nikki Bella on wobbly legs. Nikki Bella's on wobbly legs. Irish whip. Oh, into a super kick. Could that be the end? And no. Two and a half. Almost getting the victory over the former Divas champion and the current
Hall of Famer, but she, it looked like she's looking for that devastating move. It looks like she's looking for it once again. And she hits it. One, two, three. Josie Jane has just defeated a Hall of Famer. Josie Jane is on a definite roll here on NXT. A huge upset victory. I don't think this is the last we've seen Nikki Bella in NXT. But for now, congratulations to the upcomer Josie Jane. We have one-on-one -on -one action, ladies and gentlemen. Adam Cole is about to go one-on-one -on -one with Xavier Woods. Roger Strong said before Xavier can get his hands on him. Xavier would have to. Xavier Woods will have to go through every other Undisputed Era member. And if he wins, if he beats every. If he beats all other three members of the Undisputed Era, then and only then Xavier Woods can get his shot at Roderick Strong. And Xavier Woods looks like he is ready. And it looks like Xavier Woods is not playing any games here. Oh, and he's going right for Adam Cole. He is not wasting any time here, ladies and gentlemen. What a big super kick from the former member of the New Day, Xavier Woods. Oh, what a big splash. And this crowd is hyped for what they are about to see. Xavier Woods is not letting anything go. Oh, and look at this. What is this Xavier Woods? Oh my God. Uh, look at this Xavier Woods. No sunset flip outside the ring. Oh my goodness Haven't seen this vicious side of Xavier Woods in quite some time Big frog splash and Look at this he's looking for another frog splash one too many and I don't, Adam Cole has not been able to get into this match yet at all. This could be his chance to get back into the ring, into the match. DDT to Xavier. Going in for the pin. And a kick out from Xavier. Oh, what an innovative uppercut from oh and that that took me off guard 
And it sure took Xavier off guard as well. Adam Cole looked like he was looking for a brain buster on the outside. And look at this. Xavier Woods is not letting up. Look at this, Xavier Woods. Oh, my Lord. <clears throat> and Xavier Woods going up top. Oh, what a huge elbow right to the heart of Adam Cole for the victory. And just like that, Xavier Woods defeats a former NXT champion just like that Xavier Woods with the victory one down two more to go congratulations Next up, we have a number one contenders match for the NXT Championship. First up is John. Wait a minute. That's Randy Orton. Randy Orton is. Look at this. Randy Orton obviously is not up, uh, not very happy about. Gargano tapping him out last Friday on NXT. We were supposed to have a match. It was supposed to be Johnny Gargano versus Pete Dunne. Winner of the match was going to go one-on-one -on -one in three weeks with Randy Orton for the NXT Championship. But I don't think that match is about to happen. Johnny Gargano is begging Randy Orton to get into this ring. This is not the matchup. The bell has not ring. Randy Orton is hell bent on destroying Johnny Gargano here in NXT. We were supposed to have a scheduled number one contenders match. But Randy Orton has ruined that. Randy Orton is not giving up. On Gargano. Gargano able to counter. Oh, what a neck breaker of his own. And now Gargano Stomping away on Orton. And look at this. Oh, went for a slingshot spear. But it was countered by Orton. Gargano is trying to fight. He's trying to get away from Orton. And Gargano is trying to leave out of here. Oh, drop kick right to the back of the net. Oh, Lord Jesus, what a clothesline. What a brawl between these two. I, 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 I don't know what to say.
This is our main event, ladies and gentlemen. And it is a triple threat match for the Cruiserweight Championship. Unfortunately, throughout the weekend, Angel Garza got himself an injury throughout the weekend. So he has been replaced by Humberto Carrillo. Humberto Calillo from Monday Night Raw looking to bring the Cruiserweight Championship back to the main roster. But he gotta go first. He got to survive this man, the premier athlete, Tony Nice. Tony Nice has been waiting for this moment for quite a while. For him, he would say he'd been waiting for it too long. Tony Nese looking to become a two-time cruiserweight champion. But there is the man that no one will survive. The current cruiserweight champion, Tommaso Ciampa. Tommaso Ciampa holding his title very, very close to him. Ciampa does not have to be pinned to lose the Cruiserweight Championship. He has a big task ahead of him here tonight. Will Ciampa walk out the same way he walked in with the Cruiserweight Championship. This is what we're fighting for here tonight in the main event. There it is. Is this the last time we will see Champa's side plates on that belt? And look at that, they going straight for. Oh, and look at this. Oh, what a drop kick. Down goes Nice. And look at this, Tony Nice, not in a good position here. Oh, what a suplex from Champa and Humberto Carrillo. Oh, it looked like he was going for a pin. Oh, what a sit out power bomb! And look at Nice. Oh. Oh, what a take, what a cross body, standing cross body and one to guard, uh, Champa too. And now it is one on one between challenger and champion. Humberto is outside the ring. 
If he wants to win, he has to be inside the ring. And down goes Champa. Here comes Carrillo. He's back into the ring. What is it? Oh, what an arm breaker. Oh, no, that it, that cannot be good at all. Oh, and a backbreaker from Champa to Humberto. Oh, and the knee. You got to watch out for the knees. Oh, my God, what a double stop, double foot stop. Champa is out. And look at this, Carrillo, Carrillo. Oh, rope break, rope break. He got lucky there. Oh, look at this, Carrillo, with a counter. Champa is back into the ring. And look at this, Tony Nice. Oh, and look at this. Oh, what a, a face buster. Oh, and a big boot. And a spinning heel kick. What a combination. Oh, and he takes down Chumberto. Oh, and he's doing... Oh, and another combination. The same one. Boot right to the side of the face and a spinning heel kick. Went for a running clothesline, could not get it. Oh, he missed. And look at this. Look at this. Humberto is outside the ring. Oh, referee could not get there in time. Uh-oh, look at this combination. The educated feet. Oh! And, oh, he kicked out immediately. Oh, and look at this, Humberto. What is this? Went for a big move. It did not connect. Oh my God. What is this from Humberto? Oh my God. And an airplane spin Huracarana. Tony Nice is out. Oh, and look at this from Humberto. Oh my God, what a backdrop. Oh. And Tony Nice is waiting in the ring. What is this from Humberto? Oh my God. He's looking for it again. And look at this. And Tony Nice taking care of the champion. Oh, what a jump at high knee. Oh, and what is this, Humberto? Oh, Humberto taking care of Tony Nice. Humberto, if I was Humberto, I would have went straight in with Champa there. And once again, them educated feet.
I think I think Humberto is out of this match and what is this oh lord what a t what a move what a maneuver and Humberto just standing on the apron oh he's back into the ring Oh, and he's taking care of Humberto right now. Oh, white noise. And Humberto is out. And out goes Champa. Tony Nese looked like he didn't really mean to do that. What a takedown. And look at this, Humberto taking out the trash. <clears throat> oh my God, and he just plants. Oh, but he, 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 not too smart. A little bit of that inexperience. Oh, and a clothesline from Champa. Uh oh, Champa. He could be looking for that knee. Oh, but knee saw it coming. Here come Humberto to ruin it. Oh, and a kick right to the back of Champa. And Champa with the pin, going for a pin. Could this be it? One, two, and no. Tony Nice stuck in the corner. What is this? Another white noise. Oh, and look at this Champa with a power bomb. Uh oh, Champa, he looking for that knee one again, once again. Oh, this time he connects. He connects this time. And oh. And Nice is barely able to kick out. And down goes Humberto. Mm -hmm. What is this? Tony Nice. He's pulling down the knee pad. Running knees. Oh, and Humberto. Humberto. Looking for his time to shine. Oh my God, them elbow strikes. Uh oh. Oh my goodness, and he connects with the second. And a kick out from Nice. Humberto, so close to winning his first championship here in WWE. Oh my goodness. That knee did a number on Champa. Champa is not moving where he is now. Oh, and the takedown from Nice. And Tony Nice is not playing games anymore. What triple threat action here tonight?
whoever wins is walking away with the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. Oh, and look at this. Tony Nese, what is this? Oh my God, what a pup handle slam. Uh-oh. And Champa looking to reap the rewards. Oh, and Nice able to stop the pinfall momentarily. Oh, look at this. Tony Nice prop. He probably just lost his chance. No, Champa is rolling out the ring. And look at this, Humberto. Oh, and the elbow strikes yet again. And he's looking for it again. Oh, and he gets it. He gets it. Oh, and Nice able to kick out. My goodness, where is he getting the strength from? That is the question. Where is the strength coming from? Out goes Humberto. Oh, and what a suplex. German suplex from Champa. And Champa, I think he thinks that's it. Tony Nice once again able to get the shoulder up. He is very looking. He is really looking to once again to become cruiserweight champion to run in Nice. But but Humberto is back in. Humberto once again messing up. Tony Nice's chances. Oh my God, what a backbreaker. And Tony Nice is out. What a triple threat match this is, ladies and gentlemen. Put down in the comment section, who do you think is going to walk away as champion? Oh, and a tilt the world backbreaker. Oh, and look at this the educated feet of Tony Nice. And look at this. Tony Nice looks like he's trying to make sure Humberto stays out of the way. On a takedown from Champa. Tony Nice, Tony Nice, running Nice, and, and Humberto is still down. Could this be it? One, two, Tony Nice, Tony Nice is a two time cruiserweight champion. This game, bro. This game is retarded. This game is retarded.
This game is retarded, bro. It just straight up is. It's retarded. This game is retarded. This game is retarded. This game is retarded. This game is retarded. It really is. Anyway, y'all seen the match. Tony Nese is the new cruiserweight champion, but the game is retarded. So I'll. Uh, uh. Anyway, please leave a like. Please comment. Please share and everything for my heartache that I put up with with this game. <laughs> anyway, I hope you like this episode. And um, until next time, deuces.